Hello everyone, welcome to this video and in this video I'm going to show you how you can fix if photo room is not saving your photos to your gallery. So when you're basically just starting a project just like this, we're basically just going to remove the background of something extremely quickly so I can show you guys what is currently happening. So you click on export and then you want to of course click on save image. So what you need to do if it's not saving your photo to your gallery, it's most likely because you are clicking on save to files or you're just not clicking on anything and simply clicking on done right here. But what you actually need to do is you need to actually click on export and click on save image with that photo gallery icon of you. So if you're on Android, you want to make sure you can save image with the photo, uh, with the icon of your uh, gallery and on iPhone, also the iPhone, uh, the uh, photo gallery icon. So just simply click on save image just like this. And once you have done that, you can head over into photos, recent, and you can literally see right here that it just saved it to my gallery. Now, if you're 100% sure that you already did that, then what you can actually do is head over into settings because you maybe have a setting set wrong over in settings. So what you need to do is you need to find the photo room app right here. And now what you need to do is click on photos. And you need to make sure that photo library access is set to full access. If this is not set to full access, literally the photo room will not be able to have access to your gallery, meaning it can't upload and export photos to your photo gallery. So make sure you always set it to full access. Now, if you've already done that and it's literally still not working, then I, what I would simply recommend doing is just clearing the cache of the photo room app because this most of the time fixes a lot of issues with your photo room app. So on Android, just scroll down again where you already were and click on clear cache. On iPhone, we need to click on general, iPhone storage, just like this, scrolling all the way down and clicking on show all till we literally just find that photo room app right here. Then all we need to do on iPhone is click on offload app and this will basically just reset your entire photo room app. It will hard reset your photo room app and will clear the cache of your photo room app. However, it will keep all your data and documents, which, which is just really, really nice. All your project will still be there once you've done that. And this will most of the time just fix the issue for you. So if it did, please consider liking this video, subscribing to my channel, and I hope I will see you in my next YouTube tutorial video.